everyone. Welcome to my channel. My name is Veronica Castillo and you're in the the show called Sharon Chef. You're going to hear me again to the continue this video <laughs> when I was recording to show the, uh, my, my first mosaic blanket that I did by, um, I got my book right here. This blanket is the, it was, a, a, that I made is Indiana Afghan by Tina. Um, I'm going to leave her link below. So if you like to, she's amazing. She's um, doing a uh, fantastic, you know, um, I'm going to say the way she teach, she has so much passion and, and she goes, she goes step by step. Those, if, if you like to, you know, to start doing mosaic, it's easy. Um, when I was, when I was trying doing, and you know, I hear a lot of people, they say, yeah, Mose Blanket, I said, no, this is too much. This, the go be too much work, too much yarn. And, but no, if I'm not taking much yarn that I, I was out, this is the book that I have my old, uh, pa uh, patterns that I've, that I've been purchased. And yeah, I got this one from Walmart. I think it was $2. It was in clearance. So this is all my um, different, not just only for Tina or for, for on other people that I've been uh, purchased. So let me show you the yarn that I was used for um, my son, the the, uh, the blanket that you're gonna see continue this video. So stay tuned. Um, I want to tell you I how many yarns I use at least I use, I'm going to say for total, the, like the, the 47 to 48 skin of yarn. You're going to say, whoa, there's a lot of yarn. But let me show you the yarn, okay? The yarn that I use is just yarn, uh, Premier. And this is cream. This is a cream color. Um, this one I get in Dollar Tree. So it costs a dollar. So at least I'm going to say you're going to spend at least like a fifteen dollars on yarn, and you're going to have um, extra yarn. So um, I'm going to show you the I, I I had another project. Okay, I had another project doing another blanket for Alex. The this one that you're going to see in this video, continue this video. That is for Ishmael, and I made that for him. Um, I'm so excited to start the other one for Alex and I'm going to use the same yarn, but uh, maybe a little bit kind of different color, some one or two colors because I don't have no more in my Dollar Tree than I care this yarn, the, this color. So this one right here is the cow. This one is from Premier Basic. That's the same thing, but this one that was coming in big and the big cake, but you can find exactly like this. Um, this one is, um, it's late, it's late. So this is what they said the name right here. So in this one, I, I got two of these, the big rolls, and this is how much I have left. Uh, because I did in the, uh, the star. So other colors that you see, you're gonna see the same colors, but another one that one, and one of those uh, designs, um, but total um, in the slate, I use total for total, including this one. I mean, device and a small, like a, in a small, um, like this one, I use eight total. Um, I, I, because I, this one, um, one of the, um, the Jenny Fiber Sister Janie, she sent me these two because I don't have enough for doing the the, uh, the snowflake. So I said, you know what? She sent me this. I use, and this is how I have left just only for the snowflake and some for the uh, the, dev the device, the, the uh, one, the, uh, the, uh, the design to continue to the other one. So you're going to see in a blanket. and a blanket, I'll tell you, you know, how many uh, rounds the single I did. So that can do it in, in the, the next uh, design. So yeah, so this is the color. This is the first colors I use. And the next color I was use, well, let me show you all the colors I use in that blanket. This is all the colors. 
and this one i only uh, and i use much i think i use only one one or yeah it was two of these it was two of these it was two or one of these I used. Oh no, it was only one I used for one of the signs. It was one of these. And this one is cow, this one right here. And this one is kind of like a gray and blue, you know. So I used that one. And, and this one, this is a great, great twist. This is great twist. And this one I use for skin of this, four of this. And the blue, navy blue i use 18. i use 18 because i use this one for the border like are you going to see in the blanket in the video so it just depends the border whatever border you want to make that's the much you're going to need so i use 18 for the border and for part of the sign the sound designs and the blanket for total okay um for cream i use six of these and for this uh this is like a like dark gray this is kind of dark gray and this one i use uh eight i use date of this it was eight of this maybe i'm maybe i'm wrong but i'm trying i'm trying to keep it because i saved all the labels and everything so yeah so the light gray and this is uh miss miss i use eight of this uh and ash where is the ash wait a minute no this is ash i am so sorry yeah the ash this is ash i the ash i use three i am sorry what i'll say eight i'll just write it down right there so yeah so this is all the yarn that i use for that blanket so now let me show you for the next blanket that is gonna be for Alex. And um, so you can see the colors. Like I said, this kind of the same colors that I want to use for Alex. Um, the only one I don't have much is the navy blue. So the um, the dark color I want to use for the border. Let me, let me grab it, the one that I don't have. I'll be back. Okay, so is two colors i'm going to use in alice blanket that i'm not use in this one one that i that i because i know i know i don't have this yarn no more and i'm looking in my dollar tree but they don't have it that's okay you know that's fine um the one i'm going to use for the snowflake the design is snowflake i see how much i i already have everything um organized the colors and everything so the one I'm gonna use the border is this one right here, this dark gray. It's kind of like a charcoal. It's like a charcoal color. And you see the blue, I don't have much. Whatever I have, I'm going to use it. And um, so this one right here is gonna be for the border and I'm gonna make some designs, the same thing I did with Ishmael blanket. Um, and I have a lot in this color and in this color. So I probably, um, for for the, the border i'm going to use this and this together so you know so i can make in the same uh design so the the different color i'm going to use in this one is this one right here this is the name is ice blue this is the ice blue this this one and this one that's the only two colors different because i don't have this that's gonna be fine you know so that's gonna be the same blanket, the same size, um, and already got the yarn organized. So that is what I going to. Um, sorry guys. Uh, so that is the um, the blanket I going to make. So let's go see the finished completed blanket that was for Ishmael, um, and. I hopefully you like it if you like to get the information about well this yarn you can you can look at in premiere and um this is a premiere yarn you look in website you can you can find these colors and the bigger row so that is much better you know if if you like to do it i got i i like to go in my dollar tree because my dollar trees i had three or four dollar trees around me so i can check it out when 
you know, in case I need something extra colors. The only one I'm not even finding. I think I found one or two of these, but I said, you know what? I'm not taking it because I need at least more the dolls. If I don't find them, I'm not taking it. You know, I'll leave it. So, um, but yes. So if you want to know the information, like information that means um exactly for each yarn I use. I will send it to you. Just email me and I will send it to you. And um, that I did for for that blanket, I did 174 or 175 change. So, like I say, that blanket is not like big, big, but this really long, you know, like for, for his bed. And, um, but yes, guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Hopefully you like it. Don't forget, give me a thumbs up. And when you're new here, just get the notification bell twice and um and be part of my La Maisie family. So let me let's continue this video and you're going to see my fi the finish the first mosaic blanket by Tina. Um and it's the um Indiana Afghan. I try to remember, you know, Indiana Afghan. And um, but yes, guys, thank you so much for watching this video and this video continue and leave in the comments what you think. Have a wonderful, wonderful yarn day. Bye. Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel. My name is Veronica Steele. And you're Steele the show, Crochet and Chef. And I'd like to share my first mosaic blanket um, that I did the last past year. And um, as for me, take it. I'm going to say because I was to start with the first design and the second and not left for a while, but I want to say finish the rest. It was taking me for at least a month. So I'm going to say a month and a half, I'll finish this blanket um, because I was focused really good. I, I, I don't know, there was, I think it was, I'm going to say a, a month, one month, a month and a half, or I've, I'm really, I am don't remember, but now that, and it was too longer, too much time, too much, uh, you know um but yes yeah, so that is my first mosa blanket and let me show you this is all the design this blanket this one is for my son uh for his bed and i'm going to make one for alex and um my other son his name is ishmael and this is for his bed and i'm going to do and the same thing for alex so both they can have the same blanket um and but you can see the way i did mine is if you can count this one two three four five okay this one is the same yarn i use in this part right here this one right here is the one i use in here so between this and the next one i did six to the five uh single crochet and after I've done this, I start with the color I'm going to use in the next one. And in the middle, that one is the one I'm going to use in right here. So all the blankets is the same thing I did. And this one right here, when I start the snowflake, you know, and this one right here, I use this one, the one I was using in here. And I put just the line device. And this was this color. And the same thing I did in the device to not flag. And the next one right there, all the design is the same, um, the same rounds, you know, but the single crochet. And um, like the snowflake, you know, I use the blue and um, cream. And after that, I do more rounds. So that way I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to start using the blue for uh, the... Uh, for the background you know for the design so all this is what i did and and the last and the last one i think in in um and tina's uh blanket she only have the one is this one right here she got the snowflake and she got the last and the top right there um but i added extra more because i want this blanket long um for uh my son bed and on it's low it's, it's a really long blanket um so this one right here it was navy blue 
and um, uh, color gray, light gray, kind of not, not to not to like, but in between the dark and light. Um, and that design right there is the same. This one right here. So that one and this one that is the same thing. So um, and yeah. And the snowflake, they taken more yarn that I was thinking in this one and the small ones. And of course, the border. The border, it was another thing, you know. So it was it was uh, taking more yarn that I was thinking. But it's okay because, you know, I really love the way this look like. And I use um, navy blue and light gray in the border. And um, I have write it on everything, how much yarn I use for this blanket. And I use um, yarn from Dollar Tree. All this is it. All this blanket is made it with Dollar Tree yarn. You know the one that you got for one dollar. So, uh, but yeah, that's you know, if someone uh, like to know. How much yarn I use for this blanket? Um, I will send them by email. Just email me, and I will send to you the colors I use for the name, the colors, and where you can find this yarn. Either way, you don't you don't have Dollar Tree, or the, your Dollar Tree don't have this don't care yarn at all. So um, I can tell you, in um, online you can find this yarn too. And, and, and I'm going to say a big, big skin, not the small one. So, but yes. So that is mostly my first finished project. One of my projects finished from this, the 2021 year. So that is my blanket. What y'all think? Just leave your comment what you think. Um, I am so really excited to put this blanket in my sun bed when I will finish washing and down clean and um put it in his bed so right now it's a cold time so that's for ishmael blanket and um but yes um that is pretty much i like to share share with you guys thank you so much for watching this video and enjoy your day have a please uh, leave a comment give me a thumbs up if you like this video leave a comment what you think and um thank you guys thank you so much and everyone have a wonderful wonderful yarn day bye that is what the look in the bed that is the size that's a full size bed and that's what they look like does not cover the whole this size right here, but hey, that's okay. That is his blanket, and Alice is gonna have the same the same thing blanket, and yep, I just wanna share with you how they look, and let's see. Let me go back. There you go. Yep, that's what I want to share with you guys, and hopefully you like it.